Gunpowder? They've completely blindsided us. It appears that everything else they've done today was to serve as a decoy, even making the tanks go haywire. Right. It looks like their real target was the railway guns all along. Which means they must be serious about targeting that trade conference in Crossbell City. They wouldn't! How long can they possibly sink? So, they're intent on taking the Chancellor's head after all. Resorting to such wanton violence? This is absolutely outrageous. 
Please, let us help. We don't know if reinforcements are on the way, and it doesn't look like we have much time left. We have to stop them before they can activate the railway guns. Green's right. I don't know how much we can really do, but considering the alternative, we have to try. Right. We're about to let those terrorists have their way. <sighs> Looks like any attempt to convince you otherwise would fall on deaf ears. All right. Green, you and the rest of Group A are with me. Group B, you'll be under the command of Major Nightheart. One group will secure the gun at the right wing. The other group will secure the left. This is an actual combat situation with real lives at stake. I expect the best from each of you. Yes, sir! All right, Class 7. Our objective is to stop the activation of the railway guns. We've learned a lot at the Academy. It's time to put that knowledge to the test. Understood! Yes. My turn. Hey, go! monstrosities. Save the talking for later. We need to take these things out. Got it. You messed with the wrong teacher. Leave it to me. My turn. shall fulfill my duty as a noble. No doubt about it. Those things were the same as the one we fought outside the ground. It seems a large number of them are on the loose inside the fortress. I'm guessing that's what got the soldiers we just saw, too. It seems so. So these are archaisms. Are you certain, Instructor? Yeah, they're a kind of autonomous weapon made by a rather... unsavory group. And a real pain to deal with, too. We need to hurry, but keep your wits about you. Understood. Right.
Leave it to me. President. It's my turn. Ugh, here. Ugh, here. Ugh, here. Ugh, here. Ugh, here. My turn. You're in my way. Okay. Go! It's my turn! Sorry for the trouble. Understood. Ah! Off guard. And one for me. It's an honor to see the purple lightning in action. <laughs> Maybe you'll get a nickname someday. Crossbell stayed on the other side. There! Those are... The railway guns. They're enormous. Damn! How did they manage to get them prepped so fast? Don't tell me they're just gonna let them rip without even setting a target! Instructor! Well, they're certainly not shy about bringing out the big guns. Ugh! We don't have time for this! We need to take these things out fast! Right there with you! Let's send these Cretans to the scrap heap! Enemy sighted! Take turn. them out! <laughs> My turn! Didn't see that coming. Now! An opening! My turn!
I'll handle this. Arcus, activate! Go! sure it's safe to <gasps> railway guns no 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 don't
The Ministry of Railways wishes to thank all passengers for their patronage. This train is bound for Bereahard via Keldic. The next stop is Trista. Trista. We will be stopped at Trista for one minute. When disembarking, please ensure no belongings are left behind. Almost there. Man, spring's really in full bloom here, huh? Back home, there was still so much snow on the ground, I hardly even realized it. Those Lino flowers? I've never seen so many all blossoming at once. I'll be spending the next two years here. Wonder how long it'll be before I think of it as home. But yeah, I think I'm going to like it. Uh -huh. Ouch! Whoa, sorry about that. Are you okay? I should have picked a better place to take in the scenery. <laughs> Don't worry about it. I should have been paying more attention to where I was going instead of gawking at the flowers. It's really a pretty town, though, isn't it? Just like a postcard. Yeah, I guess that's the magic of springtime for you. I hope everything in your case is okay. Oh, don't worry about that. It'll be fine. Hey, you've got the red uniform too, huh? Yeah, but now that you mention it, Almost everyone else on the train had a green jacket. You're one of the few I've seen in red. I didn't really think about it until now. I just put on the uniform they sent me. I hadn't given it much thought until I got here either. But yeah, like you said, there have been a few others sporting them too, so I doubt it's a mistake. Maybe it means we'll end up being classmates. Hmm. <laughs> anyway, I should get going. I've got a feeling we'll see each other again at the entrance ceremony, though. I totally forgot to ask your name. Oh well, I'm sure we'll run into each other later. She's right, though. It is weird that there are so few of us in red. Are there even enough to make a class? The orbman they sent with the uniform is pretty strange too. It sure looks a lot fancier than your standard issue orbman, that's for sure. Eh, guess there's no point in racking my brain over it. Someone will probably explain it during orientation. Thor's military academy is on the north side of town. I've still got some time to look around before the entrance ceremony, but it'd be pretty awkward to be late the first day.
I shall take my leave here, milady. I pray you find victory here in both your studies and your training. Thank you, Klaus. I'm leaving everything in your hands while Father is away. Understood, milady. Oh, please excuse my rudeness, young sir. It truly is a splendid day, is it not? The start of a new chapter in the lives of so many promising youths. Allow me to express my sincerest congratulations on your admittance into this fine academic institution. Oh. Thank you very much. I'm guessing he's a butler? He certainly looks the part. That means the girl with him must have been a noble. She did have a certain dignity about her. I wonder if she's from a famous military family or something. ここが お疲れ様です。仕官学院に到着いたしました。ご苦労。お荷物お持ちいたします。無用だ。悪目立ちをするつもりはない。ですが。無用と言っている。後は適当に休憩してから。バリアハートへ戻るがいい。どうも初めまして。しかし、どうして自分の名前を？ちょっと事情があってね。今はあんまり気にしないで。それが申請した品会。一旦預からせてもらうよ。ああ、案内書にあった通りですね。確かにちゃんと後で返されるとは思うから心
本学院が設立されたのはおよそ220年前のことである創立者はかのドライケルス大帝失戦劇を終結させたエレボニア帝国即位から30年余り晩年の大帝は帝都からほど近いこの地に近年軍の気候化とともに音楽院の役割も大きく変わっており軍以外の道に進む者も,も多くなったがそれでも大抵が残したある言葉は今でも学院の理念として息づいておる「若者よ世の礎へたれ」。世という言葉をどう捉えるのか何をもって礎たる資格を持つのかこれからの2年間で自分なりに考え切磋琢磨する手がかりにしてほしいわしの方からは以上である。いきなりハードルを上げられちゃった感じだねああさすがは獅子神皇帝と言うべきか単なるスパルタなんかよりもはるかに難しい目標だな<笑>そうだよねぼくはエリオットエリオット・クレイグだよリーンシュバルツァーだそういえば同じ色の制服だなうんどういうことなんだろうねほとんどの新入生は緑色の制服みたいだけどあ向こうにいる白い制服は貴族の新入生なのかなあそうみたいだなだがどうしたのあいや何でもない以上でトールズ士官学院第215回入学式を終了します以降は入学案内所に従い指定されたクラスへ移動すること学院におけるカリキュラムや規則の説明はその場で行います以上解散指定されたクラスって。送られてきた入学案内書にそんなの書いてあったっけいやなかったはずだてっきりこの場で発表されると思っていたんだがはいはーい赤い制服の子たちは注目どうやらクラスがわからなくなって戸惑ってるみたいね実はちょっと事情があってね君たちにはこれから特別オリエンテーリングに参加してもらいますえ特別オリエンテーリングふむ<笑>ま、すぐにわかるわそれじゃ全員、私についてきてえ、えっととりあえず、行くしかなさそうだやれやれだなえっと本当どういうことなのかなわからないがとにかく行ってみよう怒って士官学院の裏手ずいぶん古い建物みたいだなん
場所で何をけっ訳がわからないぞまあ考えても仕方あるまいな,なんかいかにも出そうな建物だよねそうだなほっほうあれが俺たちの後輩ってわけだなまあ名目こそ違うが似たようなものだろうねわたしたちの努力が報われたのならこんなに嬉しいことはない一年間地道に頑張った甲斐があるというものだよだよなーってお前は努力なんてしてねえだろ好き勝手やってただけじゃねえか<笑>それは君も同じだろしかしアリサくんといい可愛い子ばかりで嬉しいなこれはぜひともお近づきにならないとねええ知り合いでもいんのかじゃなくて粉かけまくるんじゃねえよお前のせいでこの一年どんだけの男子が寂しい思いをしたと思ってやがるんだ<笑>は鼻で笑いやがったなもう二人とも喧嘩しちゃダメじゃないいや二人ともお疲れ他のひよこどもは一通り仕分け終わったみてえだなうんみんなとてもいい顔をしてたかなよーし充実した学院生活が送れるようしっかりサポートしなきゃさすがは会長殿もう張り切っちゃってまあ多少の助けがないと最初のうちは厳しいだろうしねそれでそちらの準備も一通り終わったみたいだねああ教官の指示通りにねしかしなんというかそれは同感だぜ本年度から発足する訳ありの特別クラスせいぜいお手並みを拝見するとしようかねもらうわよろしくお願いするわねな七組そそれに君たちってふん聞いていた話と違うなああのサラ教官この学院の1学年のクラス数は5つだったと記憶していますがそれも各自の身分や出身に応じたクラス分けで。おさすが首席入学よく調べているじゃないそう5つのクラスがあって貴族と平民で区別されていたわあくまで去年まではねえ今年からもう一つのクラスが新たに立ち上げられたのよねすなわち君たち身分に関係なく選ばれた特化クラス7組が。特化クラス7組み身分に関係ないって本当なんですか冗談じゃない身分に関係ないそんな話は聞いていませんよえっと確か君は…マキアス・レーグニッツですそれよりもサラ教官自分はとても納得しかねますまさか貴族風情と一緒のクラスでやっていけって言うんですかうーん
そう言われてもね同じ若者同士なんだからすぐに仲良くなれるんじゃないそそんなわけないでしょう<笑>君何か文句でもあるのか別に平民風情が騒がしいと思っただけだこれはこれはどうやら大貴族のご子息殿が紛れ込んでいたようだなその尊大な態度さぞ名のある家柄と見受けるが。ユーシス・アルバレア貴族風情の名前ごとき覚えてもらわなくても構わんがし次第名も東の黒い泉州を治めるアルバレア公爵家の大貴族の中の大貴族ねなるほど噂には聞いていたが。どうしたその大層な仮面に誰もがひるむと思ったら大間違いだぞいいか僕は絶対にはいはいそこまでいろいろあると思うけど文句は後で聞かせてもらうわそろそろオリエンテーリングは始めないといけないしね<笑>オリエンテーリングそれって一体何なんですかそういう野外競技があるのは聞いたことがありますがもしかして門のところで預けたものと関係があらいい感じてるわね。それじゃ、早速始めましょうかえっしまったうわっうわっうわっやっ<笑>ほらフィーンサボってないであんたも付き合うのオリエンテーリングにならないでしょうが<笑>めんどくさいなほどの建物の地下か<笑>くだらんまねを<笑>心臓が飛び出るかと思ったよリンは大丈夫え何と言ったらいいのか<笑>えっととりあえず申し訳ないでもよかった無事で何よりだった。
にしてもここは一体うん何か置かれてるみたいだけどあこれはと一緒に送られてきた携帯用の動力機かそれは特注の戦術オーブメントよこの機械から通信機能を内蔵しているのかま,まさかこれってええエプスタイン財団とラインフォルト社が共同で開発した次世代の戦術オーブメントの一つ。第五世代戦術オーブメントアークスよアークス戦術オーブメントアーツが使えるという特別な動力機のことですねそうクォーツをセットすることでアーツが使えるようになるわというわけで各自受け取りなさいていた武器と特別なクォーツを用意したわそれぞれ確認した上でクォーツをアークスにセットしなさいうんとにかくやってみるかまったく一体何のつもりだのはあれか僕のはあっちだ行ってくるね。Joking. <laughs> And just where do you think you're going? Were you planning to wander off on your own without saying anything? 
I have no interest in becoming friends with anyone here. And I'm surprised that you, of all people, give a damn what I do. Unless you've suddenly decided you do want to keep company with one of those stuck-up hedonists, after all. Still, if you're afraid of the monsters, I suppose I could accompany you. After all, what kind of Erebonian noble would I be if I didn't have at least some degree of prowess with a sword? And noblesse oblige dictates that it's my sacred duty to protect powerless commoners such as yourself. What? what the hell? Nobody's asking your High Excellency to deign to help us! If that's how you're gonna be, I'll just find my way out of here before you! I'm perfectly capable of taking care of myself without some relic of an outdated class that's still dragging me down. <sighs> um... What should we do? The only thing we can do. We should begin exploring these ruins ourselves. I believe it would be prudent to remain in small groups, however. Would the two of you have any objections to accompanying me? Oh, no, that's fine. It would be a huge help, actually. And you're welcome to join us as... Well, I suppose that's a no. Perhaps we'll run into her along the way, and she can join us then. So, shall we be off? I'm certain you gentlemen will be fine, but... Do take care. Okay. If you'll excuse us, please. Huh. <sighs> <laughs> nah, it's such a hard first impression there, huh? You can say that again. I'll have to clear things up with her later. Anyway, how do you guys want to do this? Should the three of us stick together, too? Sounds good to me. I'd get pretty anxious wandering around a place like this alone. No objections here. I'd be happy to accompany you. I don't believe I've introduced myself yet. My name is Gaius Warzel. I just arrived in the Empire, so... Any help you can offer would be much appreciated. Oh, so you're from abroad. I'd been wondering. My name's Reen Schwarzer. It's nice to meet you. I'm Elliot Craig. So, you fight with that? Of course. Why else would I be carrying it? It's a spear, but it has that odd cross-shaped head. It looks kind of awesome. Think of it as combining the best parts of a spear and a poleaxe. I was pretty handy with it back home. But speaking of weapons, I have to say, yours looks pretty unique. Oh, this thing. Is it a staff? Wait, no. It's an orbment, isn't it? Both, actually. It's an orbital staff. The tech is pretty recent. This one's still a prototype, more or less. Back during enrollment, they told me I had some aptitude for it. So when it came time to choose, I just sort of ran with it. Interesting. I've never seen anything like it before. Can't say I have, either. They're still in development, apparently, so there aren't too many around just yet. But that said, I'm curious about what you've got there, Reen. Oh, my sword? Yeah, but what kind of sword is it? It's different from the kinds of swords I thought the people in the Empire used, though. It's an Eastern style of saber called Itachi. Any way you slice it, though, it's basically a longsword. Wow, that's one beautiful blade. The craftsmanship looks exceptional. They're renowned for the layering of their steel and the sharpness of their edge. Truth be told, though, I'm still a little hesitant to be swinging around something this dangerous. Seriously? If that's what hesitant looks like, I'll bet confidence will make you unstoppable. Well, you sound like a good guy to have around when the going gets tough. Speaking of which, I think we've been standing around long enough. We should really be getting ourselves into trouble. I think I can manage that. You saw it yourselves. Trouble has a way of dropping in on me. Let's take it slow and steady, though. We need to adapt to each other's fighting styles to really gel as a team. Got it. 